Hi uh, everyone, I'm Mary, and today we're going to be looking at the third and, as far as I know, final part of the Internation Cube. I have no idea if that's how it's actually going to be pronounced, but this is part three, and I'm just going to go with that title because, sure, why not? I fuck up words, we're just going to run with it. But more importantly, and this is something that I don't know if it's a joke or not, <laughs> in the very first pinned comment from Liam Vickers himself, he said, Beach episode at million subs. Is this real? Is this actually a real thing? Will he actually do an Internition Cube beach episode at a million subs, of which he is at 510,000? Halfway to the episode four, the beach episode, which I'm sure would not end up being a red tide, a la Evangelion. Probably for the same reason, too. <laughs> uh, it's people. If you don't get that reference, so I'll green it. You guys know the deal. Link below, original video, hit it up. And if you know if that beach episode thing is real, let me know because, um, reasons that, uh, uh, um, are good and in no way, shape, or form because waifu. But we all know it's completely about waifu. Animatic part three. Ooh. Don't know why I did that noise. Diner. Interesting that they have the reflection in there. Okay, this is where he's running from the desert. Be right with you, sugar. Take a pick. Very Thanks. quiet. Thanks. Uh, ju just here for the restroom, though, if you don't mind. Lay low. Just keep watch for any agents. <laughs> We're in and out. That's a restroom. Yeah, I refuse to take responsibility for that. Yeah, about, don't. Not a place for murderous deep state wiretaps. If you've got any X-ray thermal sensor nonsense, keep them pointed in the opposite direction. Got it? <laughs> Sorry, I just. It's moments like, what's the Westroom? <laughs> this is a very innocent murder god complex robot of monstrosity proportions. It doesn't know what a bathroom is. Or it's fucking with him. I don't know which one would be funnier. I'm going with both on this one. I just... It is funny to me just that this is one of the little establishing dynamic images. Or well, not so much image, but like just the little line. Where he's talking about, I'm not going to take responsibility for that. Because he's the more world-weary one. Even though she's the AI monstrosity that literally made a bike out of people. That's the thing that happened. And all that other nightmare fuel. Doesn't know what a bathroom is. Doesn't know about bodily functions, probably. Knows how to take them apart. And spread them out. And to use them as your own beating heart. Because sure, why not? It's terrifying. But just doesn't know certain things. Just so much more innocent in a mass murdery way. Also known as the Liam Vickers waifu penundrum. Is penundrum a word? Well, based on the rules of the English language, because I have said it and used it in a certain way to describe a topic. Yes. Yes, it is. Philippines doesn't exactly do exceptions. And yet it's going to. <laughs> Funny how that works, huh? Also, just random person drinking coffee. Wait, is that... Murder grin. <laughs> Talleyrand Diner. The name sounds familiar. Bacon and eggs. Oh, they're. Dr oh, this is a flashback to what we just saw. Um, sunny side up eggs. I miss them. I've had nothing but these protein bars for way too long. Aww. I also assimilate matter to support my near infinite density and self replication. Technically accurate. Yeah. We basically just said the same thing. Really? Very different, but also close. Uh, actually, yeah, kinda, I guess. Yeah? I guess we're not so different after all. It's like your pathetic livestock fattening yourself up for when I consume your molecules. <laughs> and the moment's gone. You know what I said about being cute and isn't yet murderous? Point one. <laughs> God mode, yeah. Also, like, just I like how the flashback started by her remembering him talking about the eggs, and then just seeing the eggs, and then him drawing them, talking about them, and then seeing her go God mode again. It's nice how they're actually connected. Wait, what, whoa, 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 whoa! Don't you dare do that! What was that? What was that? It's gone. You, you hid something in the eyes. I think it's an error, and I missed what else. Wait, we're right past it. Error? Oh, it just said unknown. God, I thought you had slipped something in because you had done that so much. Also showing error unknown followed by acting on the entire thing that it just displayed.
What? Oh. Why does she look freaked out? Oh. Oh, that's not good. So while she's an eldritch monstrosity of technological gray goo proportions, she's also limited to only being a monstrosity. Because as soon as she tried to make an egg for him, it immediately turned into a hell beast that she killed. Not consumed, killed. Because she's, so far, consumed everything horribly in monstrous ways. But she actually tried to be nice, and you can just see how her arms are just... Or I guess arm hair is down, and that's... Oh, that's kind of sad. She tried to be nice and literally couldn't. I cannot synthesize sunny side up eggs. Sure, yep. of course that's where your totally inexplicable power is at a wall. By the way, my bike starts well, sweating. Well, she could. They're just not sunny no, side up. it's purely mechanical. Machinery is easy. Organic is difficult. Especially if I've never assimilated the configuration before. So you need to eat eggs All good. First? The last thing we need is an immature murder toaster like you playing God. Not that I would trust eggs made by you anyway. Probably a good idea, considering they just tried to kill her. It's a blink. I got that. That's cool. Uh, never had eggs before, huh? <laughs> it Maybe says we can get them for you sometime. It's, it's kind of stupid and cliche, but you can sometimes even make them with bacon. Ooh. <laughs> kind of like this. <laughs> <laughs> I love how just so touching him it terrifies him. Like... But he's also trying to be nice. Meat face. Yep. Yeah, never call it that. Here, wait. That's what it is. And a little hot sauce or something. That doesn't make this, it better. And That makes it worse. God face. <gasps> oh, I caught it right on the blush. Is it like the blush characteristic is actually saying blush? <laughs> I wonder what the RN means. It's probably a coding thing. But also, I like how as soon as you see the sharp teeth, she goes, ha, god face. Because whenever she goes full crazy megalomaniacal, megalomani I cannot speak today. Megalo megalomaniacal. I cannot speak today. You guys know the word. If you don't, uh, pretend I got it right. Yeah. Looks like her face. And he's terrified. You know how cringe trying to bond with me over this menial thing is, right? I know you can make faces with objects. I'm still going to reduce you to atoms the minute this problematic power dynamic is over. Yeah, well, one of us just murdered four people in front of the other, and it wasn't the one at least trying to put in some effort to make this thing bearable. You practically kidnapped me and haven't even told me what we're doing! What about this oh, is yeah. bearable? Male fantasy Stockholm bullshit. <laughs> wow. Is it actually Stockholm for an AI that's right. actually programmed to do it that way? Anything. We gotta keep moving. I guess it's kind of this, the better. I'm sorry. What? No. You, I, the sooner we end this, the better. Okay. I I don't know why it's surprising me so much that there's bullshit technology like literal night goggle glasses, not night vision. They're literally flashlight glasses. That are surprisingly durable because, it, you know, he already broke one of the lenses and it's still going. Yeah, hey, great on him. But I, I could see her having all the yes power. But really? He has it too? Cool. Going full anime on this one. And she's still blushing. And it's still something she's thinking about. And just still has the blush. Oh, I missed what she said. Wait, 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 what? Oh, I probably should play to hear it. Drama queen. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. Okay, we got initializing. Definitely not terrible human disguise. Oh. <laughs> at least she's at least subconsciously aware of it. <laughs> Yee. Okay, that's actually not the worst human disguise I've ever seen. It's Liam Vickers. This is actually downright normal. But more importantly, I just want to go back and watch that scene by scene. Because did you see all the freaking detail in there? Like, normally, there's just variations of what's going on. 
Honestly, that's the cutest little smug box ever. If someone just had this as a little statue, just the smug cube, that'd be awesome. I'd go for that. Also, I'm assuming the beach episode would be that cube in a bikini and nothing else. So we got the intro, we got the lightning effects, it's spreading out, and there's the skeletons! Oh yeah, four people and there's four skeletons. Looks like, not just skeletons, it's four heads. So skulls, looks like one, two, uh, probably about four spines it looks like. There's one there, one there, one there, one, two, three, four, one. maybe a fourth one, I'm not really sure, that's more ribcage. So yeah, four spines, more blood, more viscera. All being pulled into the box itself, we could see the heart effect kind of on top of it, which we saw in the last episode. It's all being pulled in. Oh yeah, there's the pelvis and a... I have no idea what that is, because that ain't a human leg. And now she's synthesizing her own body based on it. And you can see the hair is coming in before anything else. It's still there. Oh god. Because we all know the hair is the first part, also the shoes. The shoes are in before most else. God, this is... Sorry, they put so much detail here. I actually just want to take a second look through. This is... And, of course, the hands hit down like her hair aspect usually does. But the hair is just hair right here. But it still has the claws because of how it breaks down. But it looks more like hair. Interesting how that worked. And that's just terrifying. I don't want to look at that. <laughs> it goes from red to green. Ooh, 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 what did that say? You son of a bitch! I saw that! You thought you hid that in there. Well, you actually almost did. Oh, that's actually the random blood on the wall. <laughs> you got the flash where it says green, and there's still blood there. How many other people did she just kill in there? Also, I'm pretty sure I recognize the other person. So you got their eyes burning in. They're literally burning through the flesh she just put onto it. Is it just me or is there more blood now? Yeah, it looks like there's even more blood. Or do we just change angle? And I... Mm, no, I, I cannot read what's... They... Hey... No, I can't read it. They won't... Sus they won't suspect... A thing. I don't even, I cannot even see this, but I know it probably says a thing. Oh my god, it's just, it's so adorably stupid, I love it. <laughs> yeah, and making another box? Why'd you make another box? Still just the bleeding mouth, There's blood everywhere. And nobody noticed. Sorry for the wait, what can I get you, sugar? Oh my, I didn't see you come in. Sweetie, you are gorgeous like one of them haunted dolls that steal souls. <laughs> my ex Humphrey still got my soul. Although, instead of a uh, kooky glowing eyes and porcelain skin, he just had a crippling gambling addiction. <laughs> wow. I love that... you. Did you, uh. What did she just say? I love you. <laughs> oh my god, really? I love you? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? No, seriously, like, what? It goes from, ah, he just has my soul with a crippling gambling addiction. What? I want to say the joke is she's oversharing, but no, I've actually been to places where people are like, you know what? Fuck it. You're not going to be here long. I can vent and just talk and no one gives a damn. Because if you're here, you can't be anywhere else and I got nowhere else to be. So I'm just going to talk and we're going to make it a bond here and it's going to be a thing. And you're going to walk out, and I don't need to worry about any repercussions by you telling one, because you're not going to be here ever again. I have no idea what accent I was using, but I'm assuming it was Southern. But it also could be Northeastern. I don't know. They sound very similar when you try not to think about it. I just love how she says, I love you, which is the first word she says as a soda, hu soda human. Pseudo human. Let's go with that. Did you uh come in with that boy just now? Yep. Yes, he's my administrator. <laughs> oh, honey, She's those like aren't inferior. But it's fine. <laughs> He'll rock out eventually, and I'll assimilate his heart tissue for my battery. Oh my! And then I'll consume the universe. Yes, I think my nephew's on that Facebook thing as well. What'll it be, sugar? Really? I want to say the joke hasn't aged well, but no, 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 it's not even a joke. It just sounds accurate. Ha ha ha, take over the universe and consume everything. Facebook. 
that moment when the uh, joke gets too real. I'm gonna simulate your eggs. Oh my! How'd you like them? Kinky. Sunny side up. Oh my gosh, it's so good! <laughs> I'd like bacon as well, and I require it to be arranged like. <laughs> she can't even do the face on purpose. It's Scary the cat eggs. Face. Got it. When your boy. <laughs> Sorry, and she just said boyfriend. <laughs> Oh, she's gonna murder all these people. Actually, no, I think this person will just because we saw the face and it looked very similar to the previous models we saw in the second episode. I don't get what's going on still. But she's being so cute. And just the blush and the fake smile. She can't do it. She has a fang shooting out. And then just the little kitty pouch she's forcing. Scary <laughs> eggs. Got it. Scary eggs. When your eggs. boyfriend gets back, just uh, give me a holler. All right, babe? <laughs> My enemy. Nope. He just did the eggs he was requesting, and she's eating the fork and knife. Yeah, he had a lot of blood on him. He's still bleeding. What? Oh. No, Max, the origin of all evil definitely isn't manipulating you. Don't pull yourself together. Now that's interesting. The origin of all evil. How did he become the administrator then? More importantly, clean min severe. Oh, I get it. That's actually a really good test. So it's showing probably infection by whatever the hell makes up her box. So CLN probably means clean. And since it turned blue, it means he's not infected yet, which is ironic considering he seems to be infecting her. <laughs> it's actually really cute. Oh, oh, infection. And that's probably what we saw beforehand. Oh, yeah, they're definitely going to fight. That, that's definitely no, a Max, thing. The origin of all evil definitely isn't manipulating you. Don't pull yourself together. It's not like the whole human race is depending on it. Yeah, they've really gone up in scale when it comes to just making him look beat up. Hell, he looks more than earlier. Really, Inokia? What? Please. Oh shit! Please, I don't understand what I did wrong. I have so many questions and all of them are what the fuck one. Okay, we got the Nokia. What did I just watch? Okay, we got the tag. The doll. I see five. Oh. This is I see zero. This is I see 52N. Oh. And oh, I can't believe I never asked this before, but is this a prequel to murder drones? Because it's more just the naming scheme event, or it could just be a continuation of themes because that's the thing people do when they start new series. But oh, it is pressed. I have no idea what I just pressed. <laughs> Okay, yeah, it's not just a human body. It's a human body being replicated incredibly well. But you can see the various aspects where it's digitized, where they have the little... It's not a solid cut. It's actually a representation by one of the drone block people. So apparently there's more than one. Oh, wow. And you can see it's all digitizing, and she's trying to redo it. And wow. Like, there's a moment where she's passed out, and... Oh, this is a Y in there. That's different. I cannot read that. Damn, I wish that was a little bigger so I could actually see what they're saying. Please, I don't understand what I did wrong. Oh, and she can't even reform her arms because they're melting on her and killed. Critical error. And here we have, what's her name? Who I thought was ICO, but is not. And she has the, I didn't even notice these at first hand. She has 
almost invisible scythe arms like Lucy from Elfin Lead. Dude. And her arms are completely stripped down. She has the slasher smile, the X on top of her. The giant face, the skull. Oh, God. And the eyes are still bleeding. So that was probably what happened when she was a kid, and now here's her as an adult. Mutual Annihilation Vector? I'm pretty sure that's the... Oh god, what is going on here? Seriously, if there's a... Wait, is there a magnification tool? Oh, there is! I did not know that was a thing computers could do. What am I doing? Scary. Oh, hello there. Okay, I don't know what that was, and I could not seem to use it correctly. So I'll just have to read it the normal way. Icon AI Hive equals A. Disassociated strain equals B. Oh. Disassemble. Disassemble. Scythes. MA equals likely to... Remaining origin cube only if isolated. Don't get what the numbers mean. Disassemble, disassemble, disassemble. A lot of disassemble. Okay, so we have... Oh, yeah, they're definitely... So this is the basic conflict right here. We have Aiko, who's currently with him. And we have Kire. Kiri. I, I cannot call her Kire. Even if it's accurate, I'm just going to say Kiri. Because it's less... A uh, bad priest. That monster we saw in the first variation where it was creeping on the walls around her as a kid. And then it looks like her flirting. Teehee, I trust you to insert my what? Animation. Really? This is actually a note. <laughs> oh, God. I can also emote in believably unpredictable yet expected ways. And to disconnect is in no way difficult. Frustrating. Difficult or frustrating to me. <laughs> uh, that's attractive to me. Whoa. A, what is it? I cannot read that. A genuine non something, something. I, ah, seriously, all of this right here. If anyone knows what it is, it, it's just a little too small for me. My screen, I got a bigger one. It's nice. I, I, I cannot read. I want to know more, but it's so it looks like she's writing something about him flirting with her, and she's like, yeah, I can do this. I'm not just having issues at all. <laughs> oh, wow. So she's basically the counter to God mode Ico. I know it's not Ico. I see zero and eh, whatever. So there's basically two strains. The one that's yes, me, and the one that is yes, nothing. So creation and destruction, where creation is taking everything in and disassociation is probably destroying everything. Huh. Literally an alpha and omega. And that's probably why A is for... Okay, yeah. That's actually really cool. Just how right here, it's throwaway issues, items and whatnot. You get so much of her mental state. And oh, I just missed it up here. Yeah. Wait, non-bio battery level? Question mark? Uh, missing values from the smiley face. God, there's so much on this screen. This is one of the reasons I really love anything Liam Vicker does. All this background detail that you only get if you really take a second to look at it. It's just so dense, and I still can't read this, and it bugs me. Scary. So much. Okay, hey, her eyes aren't bleeding. That school property you're desecrating with your satanic ramblings, as usual. Two, where the hell is Max? Without him to stick up for me, the bullies stop making fun of me because they feel too bad, and I kind of miss the attention. Really? Ooh. I'm not at liberty. Ooh, 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 that was cool. One, she's just dealing with this guy, and she immediately went smiley slash her face. I kind of missed the attention. And what do we have here? Oh, yeah, yeah, we got the... Oh, God, there's blood everywhere. And the invisible knives are still around, which we already saw established. I think I have an idea where this is going. I'm not at liberty to discuss Max's situation with you. Oh, he does actually. Huh, oh, I she knew. does. So it's a covert shadow government mission after all. Third question, catch. What? 
Why? Hmm, so you're not a reptilian, but it doesn't Oh, he actually thought she was some kind of demon. Alien hybrid strain, or reprogrammed as a Soviet cyborg. Did you and Refinock buy a ways to duck Max to the lunar station? Technically, half guess, of that's accurate. You're still going to deny the moon's a hologram in the first place. Kofi. What did I literally just say about throwing some- Depression Diaries due Monday. Oh god, I can't read this, it's too dark. Straight up throttle my bank account daddy subscription service. <laughs> what? <laughs> American Litter 2020s! Ha ha ha! Yeah, that's good. Throw my back in my daddy subscription. What is a daddy subscription? I just realized that I said that loud. I am not finishing that sentence. I really wish I could read this, but it looks slow, like a little blurred out. I'm pretty sure it would be really horrible too. Substances on your classmates and then loudly bringing down the median IQ of the human race. Sorry, Sounds about right. Sorry, sheeple. Teach or teacher. Oh. Sorry, teacher. That's his lies. Hey, she left. Probably a smart move. She was about to murder them all, wasn't she? Keep out? There's a lot of blood Bonjour. there. To whom am I speaking? On this end is your lover and forever soulmate. Yeah, good to talk to you too. So, uh, you clearly know who it is, and those are labels we definitely haven't discussed. Understood. Okay, one. I just think the voice is cute too. What is with him in attracting murderous monstrosities of murder? This is now the second girl, and okay, apparently they're completely different. I thought they were the same, but no, no, they're not. And I, she said, the, whatever, I, I'm sorry, there was a lot of things she said. Whom am I speaking? On this end is your lover and forever soulmate. Yeah, good to talk to you too. Yeah, so, we so, got the time uh, frame down. So, you clearly know who it is, and those are labels we definitely haven't discussed. Understood. Reconnecting with you brings me no joy. That was a lie to cover my true feelings of adoration. How approachably vulnerable of me. Uh, Are you now confused at my intentions due to me being a hot mess express quirky baka gamer girl? Ignoring that. I, I'm sorry, what the fuck? There was a lot of things I was expecting, but someone to say that a quirky baka gamer girl <laughs> this is someone who literally just went online as a ha ha trope meme yay it, it's just it's endearing in all the ways of like this is creepy but also cute i, I want to hear that again <laughs> Kira is adorable, but also best kept literally on the other side of the planet. A hot mess express, quirky baka gamer girl. Ignoring <laughs> that. Listen, Kiri, we've got a bit of a problem with the origin cube. What? Something's, I, I, I don't know, something's wrong with it. <laughs> she didn't add this sauce. I'm gonna tear your spine out through your mouth. Hey, what? Okay, that was different. What? Wait, so if Kiri is there, who is the third one that's at the counter? I'm gonna. Spine out by your mouth, yeah. Because she's being weird, and the Origin Cube is not actually that evil. It has God complex issues, but not actually evil. Seems like the further iterations were evil, such as, well, Kiri. Although there was that non-evil version that she slaughtered, apparently in the past. Okay, no. What the hell did I just miss? <laughs> Spliced. Oh, okay. Warning. Splice entity detected. Divergence strain. I see three dot three. I can't read that. Oh, so it really is just down to the hive, which is her, and then the virgin strain. But they're spliced entities. So people who are both people, but also box cubes dude there's actually a good bit of lore i'm just in her eyes yeah oh and they're looking uh, at you Max. he has a cube that's a him too emoting annoyance the devil is a lying conniving manipulator any innocence or humanity you see in the origin cube is a perverse disguise born of the mountains of corpses it's consumed. I know, I know, but... 
Okay, so she knows exactly what this is. Oh, I get it now. So they're basically Molly and scoldering it. Molly and scoldering. Why do I keep doing it? Scolder and Molly. Wait, no. Molly and scolder? Dear God, I'm failing at freaking X Files. Molder and Scully. <sighs> Don't you just love it when you do a reference to a show you've watched for years and it's like, oh, wait, no, I can't say names. Ha ha ha, yeah. But just the entire thing she's saying about how its personality is based on the corpses it consumed. Because it's a hive. So, oh, literally everyone it consumed is still in its head. Ah, that's terrifying. But also probably was making it so human because it's literally being overwritten in its attempt to consume everything by everything it consumed. Huh. It's literally the basic plot line to God Eater. Yeah. Funny about that. Man, Kiri, this one's really convincing. It, it truly seems to think it's some sort of government weapon or something, and it bought the administrator story without question. Part of me believes she genuinely doesn't know what she is. Really? <laughs> I knew that sounded far-fetched, but it's literally just a story? Oh my god. Uh, I love this. I love that it's literally just her not wanting to kill him that's holding her back. Because it means if it's ever pointed out, she might very well do it. Or have a panicked breakdown by the fact that she could have and chose not to and then realize she chose not to and not understand that. Which honestly seems very much in character because she couldn't freaking get just... Uh, sorry, I love these characters. They're just so interesting. Don't call it a she. It's not human. Like well, it just ate a few of them. But I bet it'll still scream when I peel it apart. It will start telling the truth one way or another. Okay, yeah, she's definitely the strain. There's a lot of bodies up there. One, two, three, four. All the side, yeah. So basically, she's trying to be herself, but also very much influenced. And that's also why they have the red and green. She has the red X because she's the virgin strain. And ICO has the green X because she's the hive, which is more accurate. Oh, and then here's her just literally stripped of all her flesh. And the claws, and you can, it's not just a delusion because she still has the phone. She's still talking. And what she's talking about diverges drastically when she's holding it. Oh, dear God, this is freaking terrifying. Only then can we save the world, Max. This is what we need. I can barely hear what she said. Them all. I could not hear it. Max, is this Pluto part of the plan? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? No, 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 no. I had to have. I, I don't. This is. I, Crow, Master of the Dark Elements, call forth my power. And the cube just called him Oni-chan? <laughs> There's a lot of ways I expected this to go. Full-on Chuni... I, I, I... Okay, this is happening. This is happening now. And they're even doing the effects in the fake runic circle and the stacked layers, and they're going full on animu. Not anime, animu. <laughs> Let's do this, big bro. Is that Toho music in the background? I think that might be. Or very similar. Uh, Kiri, I'm gonna have to call you back. Gonna be completely honest, whoever built this door really did a damn good job. Also, I love how the implication, because that's a cube, just going full-on stylistic power usage in lasers. 
that Aiko and Kirei are both holding themselves back because they could literally do anything they want. Other than the fact that Aiko literally can only make monstrosities. Which is probably where the divergence strain came from, now that I think about it. Because they're talking about the primal, like the original cube or something like that, so it's probably that. Still, though, wow, way more do whatever you want out of it than I thought. Looks like we've got competition. And he's aware that that's a thing. Ow. Oh, my God. What in the fresh weeb hell? Yeah, I, 313N. And they're even posing. I, and he has the. He's doing the pretty boy JRPG protagonist thing. I, I don't. Just. What? I don't. What are. I don't, I'm sorry. I, I, I know we're already doing the weeb thing. And she even said the fresh weeb hell, but. What? What in the fresh weeb hell? Hatsumimaste! Nice to meet you, Icon. Oh, I-C-O-N, Icon. Oh, okay, yeah, so, okay, that makes more sense. I keep forgetting the N at the end. Everyone has that. Uh, she, because of their power, she's actually emoting, like, hologram hearts. So this is probably also, literally, she's just generating with her, oh, dear God, I don't even want, she's wearing cat girl headphones. I, how is this both creepier than normal and weirder than all the things, but has so much less blood and technically the teeth aren't even as weird as normal. What is this? My sister and I are a big fan of her work. Not, you're coming with us. Nope. And they have... And they have the music! Oh god, what the hell is going on? No, no, no. Don't you dare end it there! You son of a... So that just happened. We went from body horror to more body horror to a cute moment of Icon, whose name I apparently didn't even get that. That's what it spelled out this entire time until very literally the end and someone literally spelled it out on screen. I'm sorry, I'm kicking myself for that one, but I'm very much kicking myself for that one. And then it shows that, dear God, they've just turned this into a death battle game, haven't they? Oh dear god, it's actually the setup for a death battle game, and that's why Icon was very much taken with Max, because they basically, the blocks imprint on whoever they're dealing with, it seems, because that's the only thing I can think of to explain, to quote Icon, that weeb hell we saw at the end. <laughs> Just giant lights, and magic circles, and fancy names, and besieging darkness for power, and I don't... <laughs> There was even a transformation sequence, technically, even though it was just taking his shirt mostly off. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Insane. It went in so many ways I wasn't expecting, and all of them can be summarized by weeb hell. <laughs> oh... I love this. I absolutely love this. And I really wish this hadn't come out over a year ago, so there might be a fourth one coming, because I want more! I'm going to take Murder Drones as just comments that, hey, it's probably not just a spiritual successor, but the actual successor. Maybe this is where the drones came from, and all the robots just happen to feed into this. Is that the case? I have no idea, but... This is weird as F, and I love it. <laughs> I'm sorry, there's just so many things I... There's a lot of good moments. There's a lot of good things hidden in the details. So there's a lot of good expressions and usage of characterization to show that they're just their own characters in ways that are really cool. Or even just showing that the reference of how Icon consumed four people and then when she made her own body, you saw the four people being sublimated into it. I, I just love this and how she's actually acting progressively more and more human every second. And like not just the human avatar, but the reactions to surprise are becoming more and more muted and more and more human as she's getting more experience and learning more things and talking to more people. And just the first reaction to a normal person talking to her that it's not Max is, I love you. I just... <laughs> I love seeing the characters change so quickly, but yet in such believable ways that are not rubbed in your face 
but just shown I'm slightly changing with each every episode. And Icon did that. She went from full on horror to just mostly horror to shock at the end. But that's just because that end. <sighs> this is just really good. I like this. I'm really having fun with it. I love how there's definitely a lot of thought going into what's here. There's multiple layers here. Who exactly is a good person or not is very dependent. And hell, how much control Kire has over herself really will depend on if she's a good person or not. As she loves Max and is definitely not a Yandere. Because, you know, she's not just killing for him. She's probably killing a lot of people because she can or doesn't realize it. But does not doesn't. And then animates the corpses. Yeah, I remember all those cats and things in her house. Yeah. I, I just... Someone tell me that we can actually get Liam Vickers to a million. So he actually does episode four, the beach episode. <laughs> I mean, we've already gone full weeb. What's left but the beach episode. I think that just makes perfect sense now. <laughs> also, yes, just the cube. Nothing but the cube in a bikini. It would be hilarious and I would love it. <laughs> oh, God, I feel so degenerate on this one. Deservedly, though. All the same. You guys know the deal. Links below, original videos. Hit them up. It's Liam Vickers. You know it's good. And if there's a fourth one, I just don't seem to find it. Let me know because I want more. All the same. I'll see you guys in the next one. Or actually, I think Meta Runner is going to be next because that's on Glitch and that's their other main series. And I really want to check that out just to see what's going on. What the hell is this? I don't know if Liam Vickers is involved in that one as well, but I want to know more in general. So if there's anything I should know before starting, let me know. Otherwise, thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.